In this video, we answer the 10 most frequently asked questions about Anne Frank. Why did Anne become so famous? Anne is famous because of the diary she kept during World War II. She is a good writer, for example, on what it is like to grow up in hiding and how she thinks about herself and the world around her. Although she was desperate and sad sometimes, Anne stayed positive and optimistic. When does Anne get her diary? The diary is given to Anne by her parents, Otto and Edith Frank, for her 13th birthday on June 12, 1942. She picked it out herself in a neighbourhood bookshop. Who is Kitty? At first, Anne wrote to many fictional friends, like Pop, Kitty, Emmy, Peen, Connie, Lou, Jet and Marianne. Some of these are names from books by Sissy van Marksveld, a Dutch writer. In the end, Anne decided on just one fictional friend, Kitty. What was Anne's life like before she went into hiding? Anne was born in the German city of Frankfurt am Main. When Hitler and his Nazi party came into power in 1933, the situation for Jews became worse. Anne's parents, Otto and Edith, decided to move to Amsterdam. Anne felt at home there. She went to school, she learned Dutch and made new friends. In May 1940, the German army invaded Holland. When it became too dangerous for Jews, the family decided to go into hiding. For how long was Anne in hiding? Anne was in hiding from July 6, 1942 until August 4, 1944, a total of 761 days, a little over two years. Who else was in hiding with Anne? Anne hides with her parents, Otto and Edith, her sister Margot, Herman and August Van Pels and their son Peter, and the dentist, Fritz Pfeffer. Herman Van Pels was one of her father's employees. Fritz Pfeffer was an acquaintance. What was Anne's personality like? Anne was bubbly. She liked to joke and she loved to be the center of attention. In the hiding place, she discovered she is actually two Anne's, a superficial one and a serious one. The superficial Anne is the clown who loves to laugh about dirty jokes. The serious Anne thinks about herself and the world around her. In her last diary entry, she regretted not yet having been able to show her serious side to the people around her. Was Anne bored in the secret hiding place? No. Anne usually had plenty of things to do. She loved to write in her diary the most, but she also did other things. She studied a lot. She learned French, English, German, geometry, algebra, history, geography, mythology, and biology. And she loved to read, especially biographies, books on history, and sometimes a novel. She listened to the radio with the others to hear the latest news on the war, but she also listened to music. Of course, there were all kinds of chores to be done. And sometimes she did office work for the helpers. Didn't Anne ever get bored? Yes, of course she did. In her diary, she wrote that she finds Sundays especially boring. The adults slept all morning and the helpers didn't stop by for a chat. Anne slept late too, so Sunday would be over quicker. Who betrayed Anne Frank? It is not certain that the occupants of the hiding place were betrayed. There could have been another reason for the raid by the SD, the Nazi Secret Service. Until now there have only been theories, but no evidence. It is still being researched. At what age did Anne die? Anne lived to be 15 years old. In February 1945, she died of typhus in the concentration camp Bergen-Belsen. 